Hey there, I'm just uh, looking for the lyrics of who didn't watch uh, Power Rangers. I grew up in the 90s, so I, I watched uh, this film over and over. And uh, there was this part where um, the young kid's father uh, in this super look good looking Land Cruiser, he's just, you know, arriving at his place and there is this song playing in the background. And I swear I spent like 15 years to, or even more, to find out what, what the song was, thanks to YouTube and everybody uploading the whole soundtrack and all the songs related to the film. The lyrics are just fantastic, and the song has this kind of uh, Beach Boys feel to it that I adore. Exactly at the at the at the right time, you know, the best moment of the song. The song finishes because the dad is arriving at the house. And he shuts the door and so the song off, and and then you're like, wow, I want to hear it on. I want to listen to it on. And one, two, three, four. When I was only a zygo, I still remember the time. When there was nothing to know or to think about Except the sound of my mind And the sun from outside Sends around down at the bottom Sends a good to ear and sternum And the words first spoke to me in sense around So when I was only a zygote uh, I think I'm not native English, so I'm not quite sure what that means, but I think Zygot, he's referring to the fact when he was be pregnant, well, inside her mom's womb as a fetus. I'm not sure. Um, I still remember the time when there was nothing to know or to think about except the sound of my mind. Yeah, and the sound from outside, right? So he could only hear what her mom would feel through her womb. Sorry, what he could feel through her mom's body. Sense around is like the, the sound system, right? He goes down to the lowest note in the whole song, which is all what sense around is about. He goes like, sense around down at the bottom. He's making it as low as he can, just as sense around system is supposed to do, right? With sound, it's the lowest possible sound. And then he goes, sensible to ear and sternum so you can hear it but you can also feel it in your sternum and so then he jumps onto this uh, second uh, verse which is like if mom if <laughs> it's just so funny so if mom had known she was expecting she might have gone to see john's instead of picking a film where the sound effects came right up through the floor and uh, and I'd be differently phone sensor and then it goes again so if mom had known she was expecting to be pregnant she might have gone to see Jaws so it's like did she go to see Jaws or maybe he'd rather she not to uh, instead of picking a film where the sound effects came right up through the floor right so instead of going to a easy film she went to one that you know which sounds just like an earthquake and I've been differently formed I think he was he speaking of he was deformed because of the vibration of the sound system right and then he goes to this uh, bridge which is in this sound and this note accidentally Nicole was found when the accidentally dark to fall and the sound to surround and then again to the verse. So nothing too fancy, it's pretty literal here. Like accidentally in a coal mine it was found, all right? When they accidentally dug too far down and found the sense around. So yeah, it makes the down below at the bottom kind of thing maybe he was looking for. I still don't know who conceived it or where they got the idea. But there I was in the eye by the exit sign, a woofer covered in wood. To shake the room when it shoots. And it says, I still don't know who conceived it. So, who got the idea, right? Or where they got the idea. But there I was, there it was, sorry, in the aisle by the exit sign. It, meaning sense around, in the aisle by the exit sign. A woofer covered in wood. I want to think he was in a music store, right? Or in a place where there are speakers and stuff. So, a woofer covered, woofer, woofer. I'm not sure. Woof, woof. A woofer covered in wood. 
to shake the room when it's shared. Yeah, like, you know, when you have to rock and stuff. So a woofer covered in, in wood to shake the room when it's shared. And then again, back to the beautiful chorus, right? So another two verse, one another verse that says, if I could swim under the water without having to breathe, if I could follow the trail to the ocean floor, like meaning down to the bottom again, right? I think I'd know what there'd be <laughs> down there waiting for me. You know, you just don't get this music anymore. And and I'm sorry, I'm really sorry about this. Uh, I always get jiggles and laugh at this because it's so funny. And it goes like, Sit a sense around down at the bottom, sensible to ear and sternum, made the fakeness realistic when the action went ballistic. One degree shy of sadistic, and the world's first spoke to me in sense around. I mean, I mean, how can you? How can you come up with such a great song? And then they extend the chorus, so instead of finishing like they would in the, in the normal, like Sensible to ear and sternum Make the fakeness realistic When the action went ballistic One degree shy of sadistic And I mean, how can you... Like, you have make the fakeness realistic Easy, right? When the action went ballistic One degree shy of sadistic Like, yeah, like, just one more, one step further, and it would just... Isn't it the best, the most beautiful, easygoing, uplifting, silly, bloody song? You know, it's just perfect. They might be giants, yeah, the band. They are so not famous in Spain. I promise you, like, nobody, almost nobody knows them in Spain. And uh, maybe in the US we're a little bit more popular, I don't know, but either way, this song is fantastic, and it, 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 it uh, has this beautiful uh, memory attached to it, which was the Power Rangers film, which I grew up with as a 90s boy, as a 90s kid. And now I can enjoy it in so much, in fact, that I wanted to enjoy it with you and share the what I find amazing about it. I will always be happy with one person. I only need one person to uh, feel good out of this. And um, thanks for choosing me to, uh, to get entertained and to... Uh, and to uh, spend your free time enjoying quality content on YouTube, which is, I think YouTube has always and will and should always be about. Thank you. See you, see you soon. Bye-bye.